I'm Christian Karasevich and I'm the content marketing manager at StreamYard. And today you're gonna learn how to use starred comments, also known as pinned comments within your StreamYard dashboard. Now, this new feature is available across all StreamYard plans. Before we begin, be sure you like and subscribe to this video. This way you don't miss any of the upcoming feature videos, tutorials and live streams that we do here on the StreamYard channel. So let's take a look at how to use starred comments within your StreamYard dashboard. So this new feature is available across all StreamYard plans. Now here's how you access starred or pinned comments in StreamYard. So here I am within the StreamYard dashboard and what I want to do, at least right now, for demonstration purposes, is I want to go look under past broadcasts. Now, here I'm going to go into the live stream reviews show that we do. We get a lot of comments during this live stream, and it can be very difficult to keep up because you're constantly getting comments and you're trying to interact with your viewers at the same time. So I'm just going to simply click on the three dots and select Enter Studio. Now, at this point, I'm gonna go into that broadcast and I'm gonna go over to the comments tab over here on the right-hand side. And now, as you can see, I have a lot of comments that I can star or choose. Now, here is how this feature works. So let's say I want to, let's find a good comment to pen. Here's a good one. They wanna know about this, you know, they have a question. So what I can do is simply hover over any of the comments in my broadcast and you're gonna now see the star icon over on the right hand side. When you click that, what's gonna happen is it's going to create this new starred section within your StreamYard dashboard. Now, uh, the great thing about this, for example, is I can just go and I can select any comments that I want to include. And this is especially helpful if, for example, if you get a lot of comments and let's say somebody's asking a comment at the beginning of your stream and you wanna make sure you don't miss it as your comments are coming in. So all you have to do is simply just select the star icon. And what it's gonna do, as you can see, the color is gonna also change. So it's not gonna be this color, it's gonna be more of a, a purple color here. And so that's gonna change. For example, then let's say we wanna include this one. Uh, this person has a great comment here as well. And let's say those are all the comments that we want to display on screen. So what we can do here, by the way, I'm gonna add myself to the stream, I'm gonna uh, hide this overlay and we're going to go back to comments and I'll show you how this works. So we have all the live comments. These are comments that are coming into your broadcast. And then now if we want to, you know, say we get to a point where we're ready to review comments, we can click the starred section. And as you can see here, all the comments that we selected are right there. We can simply click on the comment to show that comment. Now, right now you cannot reorder them. So they come in whatever order you add them or you star them in within your StreamYard dashboard. So for example, we display that one. Let's say we display this one as well. And then let's say, you know what? We're finished with this one. If we want to remove it from the starred comments, we simply just need to deselect the star and then that's going to hide the comment. Now, one thing I want to mention is that as you can see, I've removed the comment, but it's still on screen. If I want to hide that comment, I can simply click on hide current comment. And then now I'm back to my normal StreamYard broadcast with just me on screen and I have my comments. Okay, so now that is one way to use starred comments. Couple other ways that you might wanna use StreamYard's starred comments or pinned comments feature is after your broadcast. So for example, you could always go through the comments that you received during your live streams and you can star them and then address them during your live stream so that your audience feels like they are engaged. Now, what you could also do here though, is you can leave them in the starred comments section until afterwards. Now at this point, let's say you get some really good comments and you know what? You're like, that would be a really good piece of content or that would be a really good video. Instead of having to make those notes, you can star all those comments and they will stay within your StreamYard dashboard. So when you go back into the past broadcast, you'll still have those comments there. Now, the other way that you can use the comments feature in your StreamYard dashboard is simply to use it in conjunction with a live stream producer. So for example, 
if I were working with a live stream producer and I wanted to, you know, have them, for example, manage all the comments during the live stream, what I can do is I can assign them access to my studio using StreamYard Teams, and then they would be able to go in at the same time as me and flag some of the comments. So for example, they could flag this one, and then uh, let's see, let's say we wanted to flag this one as well. And then now all those comments are going to be there within your StreamYard dashboard for you to either bring up on screen or for the, you to obviously also to kind of keep in the back of your mind, maybe it's questions you want to address and so forth. But that is how to use the starred comments or pinned comments within StreamYard. Let us know what you think. And if you have any additional questions about starred comments, please leave those in the comments below. And don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel so you don't miss any future StreamYard tutorials or live streams. Thanks a lot.